wasn't there for me, no, you wasn't there for me. He wasn't there for me, no, you wasn't Alright, y'all, what is going on, guys? And today we're back with another vlog. And in today's vlog, as you can tell by the title, me and Amanda are heading out to the mall today. So, we got a little mall shopping vlog for y'all. I don't know if we're really gonna get anything. I don't know what we're gonna see there. We haven't been to the mall in probably like a few months, a month or two, maybe. And, um, yeah, so we'll just bring you guys along, record. We're gonna go to all the regular stores that we go to, probably Hot Topic, Box Lunch, Newberry Comics, uh, True Believers. What else is in there? Barnes & Nobles is in there. There's a bunch of random stores in there. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. All right, y'all, we're pulling up to the mall right now. So let's go on in. The Easter ones, the Spider-Man, which one's that? Let me see that one. Oh, Minnie Mouse. What other else they got? One. Captain America, yeah. another Spider-Man. That's uh, no, that's that. adorables. Didn't Star Wars. I said it a while ago. Star Wars or Avengers? I need to get them. No, I didn't say Avengers. I said Star Wars because I don't care for. Them. All right, y'all. Let's go into GameStop now. The Hello Kitty's sick. Oh yeah, I have that one. That's from the new um, Tokyo Ghoul line. Yeah, and they got all the Tokyo Ghoul ones. They got some of the new Naruto ones as well. And Juzo. Oh damn. Okay. They got a bunch of anime figures now in GameStop. Like, they never used to have this many, but they got Leorio. And they also have this Naruto one. I have the Sasuke version of this, but I don't need another Naruto figure. I have so many Naruto figures, but this is tough. This is tempting. I'm not going to lie. All right, y'all. We're in Newberry Comics right now, and it's buy one, get one 50 off of the manga at the front. So, that's tough. I feel like I haven't seen these at all. That's cool. The Buttercup. SpongeBob. Oh, what is it? Eeyore? Doesn't Dad have that one? I think that's the one we got him. Yeah. That's cool though. Why do I want this though? Damn, 25. That's so cool though. They got a bunch of little mystery bags in here. Like a lot. Attack on Titan, One Piece, Dragon Ball, Chainsaw Man, Cowboy Bebop, Dr. Stone, My Hero, JoJo's. Damn, got almost everything. They have a Karizawa Classroom of the Elite figure, which is crazy. Oh, Kunigami, tough. They also got all the Bleach Girls. Well, they got two of them, and then a third one, but, you know, they'd be making them look crazy. Is it the Sakura? Let me see it. Oh, my God. You need it? So, I'm going to get a bunch of Haikyuu manga right now, since it's the buy one, get one 50% off. Um, slowly making our way up with the Haikyuu volume, so I'm going to get six of them, which should be, like, what, 30 bucks? All right, we're in Lids right now, and I want that Tokyo basketball jersey. That just looks sick. I don't know, I like it, but... We got a bag full of stuff already, and we just walked in the mall. Put it on, put it on. Put it on, please, please, do it, do it again, do it again, do it again, do it again now. Oh, see? That's shoddy A, shoddy A, what's up, shoddy A? We're in Crocs right now. They got a Toy Story collab, but they also have some of the Naruto ones left, like a few. They look like kid sizes, though. They got Kakashi and then a few Naruto's left. We're in Box Lunch right now. Let's see if they have anything cool. They have a Fruits Basket car shade. Um, don't know why I need a car shade. This is their anime figure selection. Oh, they have Kid Kakashi. That's tough. And then the Naruto from earlier, but the Kid Kakashi one is actually really cool. Yeah, they really don't have that much in box lunch today. Team 7 glass set, if somebody wants that. And a, um, what is that, a, a rice cooker as well. And then this is the clearance section. It's buy one, get one 50% off of clearance. But it's mainly just like random things. Why they got blue lock pajamas, bro? I've never seen blue lock pajamas. All right, y'all, we're in five below now. There was really nothing in box lunch, so let's see. They got um, Itachi fig pin, but Hello Kitty. They have all these big Harry Potter Funko Pops at five below. They're not five dollars, they're ten dollars, but like I'm pretty sure you could like complete like the set here. They got look this one as well, and they also have the dragon, which is tough. Alright, y'all. Next stop is Champs. I want these five so bad. If y'all know me, 2006, I've been wanting these since they came out back then, but they were never wearable, but now they just retroed them. So tough. We're in Champs right now, and Amanda found a pair of pink gazelles that she wants. I've been wanting pink shoes and I wanted um Adidas. Yeah, she did. So and we'll show you them. Bucks. They're 80 bucks. They have my size. Well, wasn't that a size? Yeah, I know, but. Oh. Oh, those are so cool. Damn. W pick up. W pick up. <laughs> We're in Foot Locker now, and I think the fives like actually sold out though. Like I don't see them. I only saw them in Champs, and they didn't even have them. They just had like the one on display. So I mean, hey, the fives are coming back. Let's go. These Asics are tough. I like this color. It looks like some veggies. Again, just like Champs, they just have them on display, but these look like kid sizes. They don't even look like the regular size, but they look so good, bro. All right, y'all, my favorite store in the mall, True Believers. Let's go in. They got a bunch of mysteries. It's like, I don't know, I feel like no mystery series has been coming out. I feel like it's been the same stuff for months. Like, I want some cool new mystery thing to, like, buy and stuff, but... 
in the open figures. Nothing cool though. Oh, we're in the figure section. I'm gonna see if they have anything new, different from last time when we were here. What are you looking at? She said, what the Price hell? 34. 34 for the Sakura? That's how much it was at the other place too. They got a bunch of Jujutsu Kaisen figures, but I don't really need any. The only one I really want is a Choso figure whenever I see one, but I haven't seen one yet. So the day I see a Choso figure, I'll pick that up. Got a bunch of Funko Pops as always, but again, there's really not any Funkos that I need right now. So they're having a buy one, get one 50 off the manga section too. Damn, every place got like buy one, get one 50 today. W. Honestly though, their selection of manga is pretty just like basic and like not really like multiple volumes. Like it's normally like the first like few volumes or just like really random numbers never never like complete series all right y'all i'm in zara because amanda wanted to be here but i'm gonna look in the men's section because sometimes there's good things this sweater is kind of dope but i don't know what the front looks like is it a cardigan i think it is a cardigan oh it is a cardigan eh. i mean that's actually kind of cool i actually like it better as a cardigan but i don't know zara's been like the clothes shopping in general, I feel like everything just feels like a knockoff of another brand. Like, I know we're in Zara, so obviously that's how it's supposed to feel. But I feel like in general, there's been nothing, like, cool or new. It's been, like, the same, like, bomber jackets. Like, these same type of jeans, the same type of sweaters, like, over and over again from every company. That's why, not to sound like a little, like, TikTok girly or whatever, but, like, I do like going to the thrift because you find clothes that are just, like random pieces that you might not even know exist or just older pieces in general but yeah also this sweater is kind of cool but again like 50 bucks bro this looks like something from like fashion nova you know and i get fashion nova stuff for free so shout out to fashion nova these pants are kind of cool if they were like baggy but i think they're like more straight leg but like if they were like baggy in the way that they look like right now but like looked like that on that would be tough Hi, right, y'all. Somehow we ended up in David Buster's right now. So if I play some games, I'll try to vlog it. But as you can tell, we're probably gonna be like copyrighted. So I, I chat. We're going for the ice cream. It's over there. Um, it's the only like plush thing in here. There's a bunch of balls in here. <laughs> Woo! Fun times. Ready? Yeah. Oh my god, no looker is crazy. No looker is crazy. No. Shut. No looker. No looker. That doesn't sound right. Look at this, ready, 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 ready. What are you doing? Aww. Alright, these ones are pretty like bad unless you want a ball, but there's like random plushes in there, so Amanda's gonna try to go for it looks like Lightning McQueen. <laughs> Or like a car type thing. So it's at home. Let's see if Amanda can get one. Oh man. Are we gonna go two for two, babe? Babe, we're going two for two? Okay, wait. It is? Oh uh, I have more playing time. No. Um so the game's like broken and apparently Amanda has more turns, even though I didn't tap it that many times. Alright, let's see. Part two. Oh damn, that was babe. So bad. Bam, babe. You gotta help me. I need it to go underneath right yeah. on that side. It's not gonna mm, do it. Not gonna do it. You have one left. Damn. Come and say, I'm a sea. Bonita, sea. Shakira, Shakira. Alright, babe, you got it, you got it, babe. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, you sold. Alright, y'all, last stop before we're leaving the mall, Barnes & Noble. Let's go on in. Alright, let's see if there's any manga that I need. There's a lot in here. It goes down, like, this whole wall. So, let's see if I can find anything throughout all these titles. So, I finally found A Sign of Affection. It's a manga I've been wanting to get. I've been watching the anime, and it's so good. So, I really want to get this manga. They have two, three, four, five, six, and 7. I found the Gojo ending. I'm so hype. I've been wanting this one for so long. We are back from the mall now and we got a little pickup sauce. More than I was expecting to get today. And let's start off with the Star Wars thing that we got at Target. So we opened them in the car for a TikTok. So if you want, you can go watch the TikTok. But I didn't record it for YouTube. But it's basically adorables. If you don't know what adorables are, they're like these little mystery things. Amanda has like all of the Disney ones. Um, but they finally made Star Wars ones and they actually come with like cool packaging that you can keep. Like this is literally a Death Star. Are. and then we got a bunch of them but i gave the rest to amanda's dad because i just really wanted darth vader that's literally all i wanted and i was so excited to get the darth vader one so he looks so tough and i can't wait to put him with the darth vader section as well as 
literally the Death Star. So that is really fire. And then um, at Target, as again, as you guys saw, they have like the new Easter Marvel stuff. And I don't really get anything Marvel related. The only thing I really like is Spider-Man. Like Spider-Man is like his own thing to me. Like I don't even classify him as that. Like I just love Spider-Man ever since I was a kid. Um, as you guys know, I have like I've always had Spider-Man stuff in my room, and this one just looked super cool. Like, I don't know, I just really like the way that his, like, gold foil, and he actually looks like chocolate, so I thought that was tough and just, like, different. So, yeah, I don't know where I'm going to put him, if I'm going to put him with the actual Spider-Man section or just, like, put him in with one of the shelves, because he doesn't, like, actually look like Spider-Man, but it's, like, a cool little hidden detail for, you know, Easter. Instead of spending $60 on everything, we got it for I don't even know how much, and then a figure I got was this Classroom of the Elite figure, which was really cool, because I never really see Classroom of the Elite stuff, so I thought that was really tough to get this and I could put it on this shelf up here I really want an Ayana Koji figure so hopefully we'll get one of those soon whether it's an Android or not I really do want that so yeah that was the pickups from Newberry Comics and then staying with the manga theme at the end I wasn't even gonna go into Barnes & Noble but we winded up finding this manga right here which is something I've really wanted to get for like the past few months ever since like the anime came out I've been watching it weekly and I just really wanted to get the manga for it. Like, it's a really good series. It's another, like, romance series, but it's just, like, I don't know. I really like it. It's, like, a 10 out of 10 for me. Um, highly recommend this series. And that's a lot of manga for one day. I wasn't expected to go that manga crazy. This figure I got was this one right here, the Gojo Noodle Stopper one from the ending song. I think it was, what, ending version 1 or something like that or 2. Um, from the first season and I just really thought the fit was tough I saw I've seen this figure for like almost two years now It was in Japan for a while then the US finally got it, but it kept selling out everywhere So I've never actually seen it in store before I've only seen it like on people's Instagram feeds or TikToks. So really cool to find this at Barnes & Noble for literally $25 because everywhere I've seen it has been like 40 and upwards So shout out to Barnes & Noble and then last but not least we have two mysteries to open. Hopefully, hopefully we can pull Kenma. I did get these from True Believers. I was like, you know what? I just want to get something mystery. I've really been like in a mystery mood and there's been nothing out. But I realized that the mystery exclusives for this series is Kenma. I didn't know that. So we're going to open these up. And hopefully we did get Kenma because that's really the only one I want. But let's see. We got two of them. So hopefully we can pull a Kenma. Three, two, one. We got Ashi. We did not get Kenma. We did not get Kenma. All right, we have one more chance. We have one more chance to pull Kenma. I literally tried to feel. Oh, I guess it is, is smooth. I thought I would have felt like the man bun for him, but guess not. It was kind of hidden. All right, last but not least, come on, Kenma, please, please, because I'm not buying more of these. I do not need bag clips. I do not. I'm gonna say the blue lock one's coming out, but other than that, he didn't get Kenma. Damn, my streak ends. My streak ends. I'm not mad at it though. I'll put them on my school bag or something. They're tough. So yeah, high Q little mystery. Um, what are they? Mystery keychains. All right, y'all. I just put everything on the shelves. So I'll show you guys where I put it. I put Kara Rizawa right here with my other classroom of the elite stuff. Like I said, I got the Horikita pin. I have Kara Rizawa on an acrylic stand, and then we have two classroom of the elite Horikita edition manga. So that's a little classroom of the elite section. And then we put Gojo right here, which honestly might be my favorite figure I own, if not top five figures. He just looks so tough. And then we put the Sound of Affection manga right here for now with the Spider Man, just because. He's still next to the Spider-Man section, but he also doesn't really look like Spider-Man at the same time because of the color scheme, so it looks cool like that. And then I put the Dorable in there somewhere, and then we put the Q manga volumes on the shelf with the other ones. So we're almost completed with Q. We need, like, random volumes in the... I think we just need, like, a 28 still, and then the rest of 30, and then... Well, not the rest of 30, but some of 30, and then the rest of 40. So we're almost there. I think it's, like, nine more volumes total we need, so... Yeah, and um, that's pretty much it, I think. I think that's where I put everything that we just got today. So hope you guys did enjoy the vlog and catch you in the next one. And we out. Baby, what's the vibe? Hop inside a ride. I know you want to slide. Know you want to slide with me because I'm vibing. Baby, girl, I'm vibing. Don't show up to the party with no violence. Don't show up to the party with no violence. I take you out. I break you out. I got you smiling. My love is different, so take